Hello, everyone. Oh, returning to Elden Ring. It's been a few days, which basically means it's forever. So watch me be incredibly <laughs> rusty. Oh, boy. How are we doing, chat? Hey, Dolph. It's good to see you. I love this place. Poor Godwin. He hey, Ellie. Uh, poor Godwin. He was sexy and then died and became a fish. What a shame. Why did Ronnie do it? <laughs> Who said fish weren't sexy? <laughs> Let me see the shape of one. Oh, God. You guys are great. All right. Let's see. I'm not going to lie. I really dig this area. This is really cool, especially to find so deep underground. Like, look at that uh, waterfall. I can't wait to figure out that there's literally not a source of water large enough to support it. So, uh, what do we... Oh, right. I need a map. Uh, guys? Uh, is there a map nearby? I, I think I need a map. I was about to say, did I find a cave? No, of course I didn't. I never find nice things. Wait, what? Oh, no. Oh, no. You're not... You're serious, uh... I don't do enough damage! I need my Smithing Stone 7! Oh. There we go. I'm just going backwards, right? Yeah, I'm just going backwards. There's no point doing this. Okay, we just gotta continue... Continue forward, hello horse. At least, uh, at least my muscle memory for this game is, uh, functioning properly. Let me just double check, make sure my mic and everything. Hello? Yep, it's working, okay. Are you guys hearing the game, though? There we go. I don't know if you guys could hear the game audio. It looked like it sounded like it was very low, so I'm raising it a bit. Hopefully that uh that sounds better. Dark Souls, I'm putting it down so low, and then Elden Ring, it's like, okay. Honestly, I'm tempted to put the volume back low and raise the default volume. Oh my goodness. Yeah, Godwin. Okay, so these guys are definitely Godwin related. Yep. Yep. Look at that. Look at all of those basilisks. Also, I love how my lock on will not switch over. Uh, game? There are so many of you! <laughs> I wish it moved over to other targets if they were extras left behind. I don't like that it kind of just on the wall, but I guess that's for PvP. I wonder if America and the game came down here. I have to imagine they did. Who knows? This could be the Eternal City that, uh... Oh, no, it can't be, because Eternal Cities have to come after America, don't they? One second. Yeah, okay. There we go. Gotta make sure everything's working here. I was about to say, this could have been the Eternal City that America came from, but now that just doesn't work. I have Smithing Stone 6. Can I have a somber Smithing Stone 7? Okay, uh, I got this thing. It's called a Heima can. But I don't want to use it on you guys constantly. Okay, just let my stamina come back entirely. 
I also hear something, so hopefully it's uh, not coming this way. Are you done? There we go. Oh boy, it feels like I shouldn't be here. Feels like I should have my weapon upgraded a few more times before I come down here. Uh, poor Godwin, but yeah, if he was put here, how the hell did the royal family even manage to get down here? I'm sure they have their means. Again, whenever it comes to this type of stuff with how characters, other characters are supposed to get around and stuff, I always say don't question it. But it's not worth the effort to think into it. It's just sort of like you have to accept that there's some ways down here other than the ways we go to that other characters manage to do this. Like maybe there's some magical teleportation thing somewhere. Who knows? Kind of just got to roll with it. There we go. So it's going to take two of that every time. That uh, That's uh, not very nice. That's not very nice at all. Uh, anything behind this? God, that waterfall looks so fake from this angle. Oh, from soft. Your art direction's superb, but your graphic quality is leaves so much to be desired. It's fine. Art style trumps graphics, after all. Alright, what's this thing making noise? Oh, it's you! So, uh... So I guess that confirms that gargoyles are, uh, gargoyles have to be a, uh, gods thing, which makes sense, making the Anna Londo reference. Gotta be the demigods thing. These things are supposed to be put together with wax, right? Oh. No, I appreciate you not, uh, attacking me from down here. I understand that you're, uh, in a bit of a situation. Huh. So they look very human. But they have, like, tree parts, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. If you mess up Ronnie's quest, she instantly teleports herself blithe and EG somewhere beyond the lands between. Really? She's just like, okay, we're out. Wow! Whoa! You're telling me that these things are as weak to sorcery as the basilisks. Oh boy, and they give you 4k. Yeah! Map! That's a lot of tree roots. That's a lot of tree roots. It's very different from here. Or here. Hmm. Uh-huh. So this has to be the earth tree, right? Yeah, this is the earth tree. Okay. So this here, this is our earth tree. All the way back there. So it's not even gold from the bottom. It's only gold up top, huh? Our golden tree... It's all a lie. It's not true gold. It only looks it. Also, I find it hilarious that this city is destroyed, but the torches are still lit. Like, never change from stuff. Never change. Dang, no. I guess I gotta get up higher and climb. There's so many of these guys. So here's a question. Were these golems put here before or after Estelle? Because if it's after, uh, before Estelle, then it makes sense why they're all destroyed. Except for the two that we fight as a boss at the, at the mouth of the waterfall, which I assume is, again, just supposed to connect that, that area to this.
It just seems very weird we have so many of these gargoyles in here and they're all destroyed. That big slice, huh? Lost skill of ancient heroes. Block, then launch it forward as a blade like projectile. Ah, I see. The anime slice. The samurai. Boom. Cut bullets in half type of attack. Gotcha. I wonder if they were put down here because of Godwin. If they were, then that could imply that uh, the Eternal City was only destroyed after Godwin's death, meaning that the death of the demigods had already, uh, and the shattering was already about to occur. Which makes you wonder if Estelle might be somehow related to Godwin. Again, I find it hilarious that these basilisks are as strong as these gargoyles. I get that they've destroyed gargoyles, but come on. Maybe you guys like lined up. Oh, goodness me. Gotta go for high. I do find it hilarious that the trees are seemingly doing better than the than the place itself, but I guess they all grew back. It's like destructive, uh, destructive uh, force of a creature from the stars. Plants, though, they're fine. Meteorites don't do that much. Uh, there we go. Woo. Oh, more of these guys. I guess it makes sense. Soulless demigod and all. Oh. That is so ridiculous. Okay, so like we want to use this staff, right? Yeah. Coffins, okay. Burial. Lots of burial here, I guess. Makes sense. Human bone shards, uh huh. Smithing stone. Clarifying boluses. Wait. Madness? So either these are where these types of boluses would grow more, or it's related to madness. Was the Flame of Frenzy here? Very curious. Seems so random. Unless we're fighting, gonna fight Frenzy people here. More Smithing Stone. More Rune. You gotta be. Oh no. Yeah, no. We got a whole area to explore. I'm not doing this right away. Grace? Is there a Grace around here? Grace? Great. Wait. Uh, maybe up there? Maybe down here? Gosh, no grace. Oh, never. Never mind. That was 
was super easy to miss. Hmm. Let us see. I don't want to rest yet. I can still keep going. Nice. I can snipe them. These guys are easier than freaking basilisks. Ow. Man, I do love the physics on this tree, though. I have a little bit of bend. Maybe bends a little too easily, but I can't believe it. Let's see now. Oh, hi, buddy. Oh, well, that's, that's awkward. Don't worry, I'll be meeting your cousins in the original. Soon enough. Try using a grace mimic to find it. Oh, is that what grace mimics are for? To find other graces? I actually, t I remember them being an item, but I don't think I've ever bothered reading about them. Oh god, we need to. Okay, I need to. Wait, wait. Combat. Smithing Stone 7, I beg you, please. <laughs> ah, this game. I'm apparently constantly in combat. Where are you? Where are you, my- oh. Godwin, is it? No way. Yeah, Godwin's not there. Hello? There we go. So these things form wherever there are the ants, I guess, coming together, eating, maybe. Oh, this is useful. Of course, an arteria leaf, naturally. <gasps> no, I need. S I'm in somber smithing stone seven game. <laughs> ah! Suffering. Ah! I'm so close yet so far. resistance though, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not having to worry too much about the basilisks. More stuff there. There's that there. Sombersto Sam for both types is the most rare. Oh no. Oh no, Ellie, don't tell me that. You're telling me that the ones above seven are more common than seven. Why game? Why? Uh, oh yeah, there's something here. Smithing stone five. I could literally upgrade like every weapon in my in my box except for the ones I want at this point. Basilisk is a kind of lizard. Hey, John Kick, good to see you. The thing with Basilisk, my question is, are they cor I assume they're not corrupted by Godwin, they're a kind of, I guess, light that's produced from Godwin, right? Though so I'm curious how that exactly works. 
Because we also see stuff like small insects and things like that, but his whole thing is to live in death. So, again, how the cosmological workings of life and death in this universe function still doesn't, com doesn't completely come into my grasp. I'm hoping that it will make sense if I start ruminating on the game after the fact, hopefully. Because I don't think I'm going to understand it by the time I get to the end with how things are going. But who knows? Maybe I'll have a Eureka moment. I think I've covered everything up here, right? I don't think I've done anything else that I need. I guess it's time we go up the roots then. Yeah, that was the one with the big bowl on it. Hey y'all, yay. Let's, Let's see. So we see the buildings are sinking into the water after the destruction, huh? Stone 6. Why do I explore? My stuff is not where I want it to be, clearly. Damn, Elden Ring is a big thing exploration. Oh, there we go. Oh! New staff! That's cool. Uh, so the Corrupted Ambers. One of the saves deemed heretical by the Academy for the Legal Source to be offered through faith and addition to intelligence. So, someone took some amber corrupted. Well, I guess that makes sense because Erd Tree Root, so there's gonna be amber. Corrupted, because Godwin. Uh huh. Yeah, that makes sense. But I guess the question is who are the people who are down here doing this type of stuff? That's good. I don't see anything I'm missing from up here. farming spot if I ever need it. That's laughably easy. I think it's easier than killing trolls for more, uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure pretty sure trolls don't go down in that many strikes from my, uh, my stuff in, like, Lindgrave, so it's like, oh boy. Oh, you can get on that ledge there. Cool. Thanks for not knocking me off before. Thanks, buddy. Oh, there's a thing there, so that's probably where we're supposed to go. I was about to say, uh, is that a Loki death moment? Is that a Loki stupidity moment? No, but Loki's gotta climb all the way back up, so may as well have been. Or not. Don't 
see anything down there, so I guess that's just a way to get back down if you want. I don't see any items there, but I could be blind. There's a Somberstone 7 in Volcano Manor, another in Ainsel River, some in Noxtella, and quite a few in the subterranean shunning grounds. Isn't that the Prince of Death Staff? Yes, the Prince of Death Staff. Uh, yes, it was, slash in, slash Faith Catalyst, but the... Oh, actually, since it is the Prince of Death Staff, like you said, maybe this is Godwin's original staff, now that you mention this. Maybe it's a... Maybe he was part sorcerer. Because he uses Faith, right? I didn't consider that. Oh, it'd be so much better if I just did it through. Yeah, this like this. Oh my gosh, I have so many Academy staffs to sell. Said to be very okay. That's why it's said to be a part of the Prince of Death. So the staff is a piece of Godwin, with and the amber put into it allows it to uh, cast sorceries with faith, but the. Uh, but, uh, the fake sorceries have been corrupted, hence why it works best with, uh, incantations, or I should say prayers of the, uh, the death variety. Gotcha. Alright, you're dead. Uh, what, how do I level up again? Oh, I can level up now. Boy, you know something's important here. I'm not allowed to dismount. Or I'm allowed, not allowed to mount, I should say. Oh, boy. Yeah, we want to do this to level up and then... Uh, we're, go we're going for dexterity, right? For more casting speed. Right. Also increase Moonveil's abilities. Uh... On your the yes, it was an inside faith cows for the fools who use uh, split damage. Me, <laughs> I'm doing split on my confessor with uh, I'm putting both equally into like uh, faith and uh, sorcery, and it's not doing too bad. It's it had a rough start because that's like you know confessor was just a healing miracle, but now that I got my uh, my stuff, it's not the worst. It's still not as crazy good as like straight up sorcery build. This sorcery build is just stupid. <laughs> But, uh, I'm, I'm enjoying it. it I'm, it's helping make the- my Confessor build feels like the game, like, at a decent, um, a decent difficulty. It feels like if you actually do specialize and do, like, a build that doesn't, like, uh, spread out your stats too thin, um, and you actually just go into, like, one thing, you'll, like, murder this game for its, diff for its like, ridiculously laughably easy difficulty, at least so far. That's been my experience. We'll see. And then, uh, on your theory about the Night Folk essentially being evolved Mimic Tears that are now just human, the Night Folk have Black Sarah just like the Nox. Wonder if they were mimicking them. That would be my assumption, yes. Those would be the humans that you would want to mimic, right? The question is just... The question is why the, uh... Why they, Night Folk, ended up escaping, um... Because the idea would have to be that they're mimicking the, uh... They're mimicking again and again the, uh, the, the Nox, right? In order to mimic the human quote-unquote form. And eventually, it gives us what we see with the, uh, the Night Folk presently. So the idea is that they used to have silver blood, and then they stop. Now here's my question. Do we ever have a case where Mimic Tears have silver blood? Because we know that Nox, I think, have regular blood, right? I think only all Banorks have had truly silver blood. So the question would either be, they have to be Mimic Tears, the Night Folk, or they have to be all Banorks that somehow became normal human? But again, that still doesn't explain how they, their escape. I think Mimic Tears is the better explanation because we see it, evidence of Mimic Tears pretending to be normal in other cases. It's quite possible that the Mimic Tears we see today with the uh, red blood um, when they mimic stuff might be, uh, might be more advanced, quote-unquote. And that the older ones that eventually became human, the, they, they took a few rebirths to get 
to that juncture versus the current ones. That's just like sort of my uh, my uh, my concept, my idea. What I ended up doing was dual long swords, frost with in scaling, uh, scaling and fire art with face scaling. By end game though, the sword of night and flame did like 530 damage a swing. The silver tier has silver blood, yeah. Yeah, but I, I mean when they mimic stuff, do they still have silver blood? Obviously when they're not, but as far as I'm aware... As far as I'm aware, I think it's only Albinoric so far that have had silver blood, yeah? Silver Tears. Oh, hey. Oh. Hello. That problem's resolved. So, my options are go into a cave. And that's about it. Wait a second. Oh my god. Oh. oh my god, I almost missed the, the hole. Wait, is this it? Oh my god, this is it. How do they keep doing this? There's a hole right here. And somehow water's not pouring down here. It's pouring over here in such large amounts. And this is the source of that giant waterfall? Are you kidding me? Okay, something weird is going on with water in this universe. There's... This is the source of all... So we have water source here. And water source here. For all the water... Here. Coming from here. That comes all the way here. What? The Shifra River is, uh, crazy. What the hell? And the Ain- uh, What is this? Is this the Ains- I have to assume this is the Ainsel River then, right? I have to assume that this will take me here, maybe. Right? Yeah. Like, this is just- This is just bonkers. Like, what the hell? Uh, okay, I guess we gotta go down. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm not crazy, am I? I don't have other stuff equipped, so I don't think I'm crazy. <gasps> I got it! Chat! I got it! <laughs> My beautiful baby! Somber Smithing Stone 7! Fuck yeah! I'm so ha Oh. Do you have 8 and 9 too? Do you have 10? I don't know if I have 10. Let me double check. But okay. I, as soon as I drop down, I need to deal with that room bear. Because I assume it's going to have something special. I pray it does. Otherwise, it's just a room bear behind a waterfall. Okay. But yeah. Actually, we can upgrade. We can upgrade my stuff first. So I'll do even more damage. Okay, let's see. What do I got? What do I got? What do I got? 7, 8, 9. Yes! I'm there. I have 7, 8, and 9. I don't have 10, but that's fine. You know what? Just so I can save all my runes. By the way, guys, you may have noticed, I did go through my... I forget if it was last stream or whatever, but I did go through my runes to clear them for more level ups, and, uh, I do not regret it. Come on, give me level ups. There we go. I can now level up my, uh, my, uh, my weapon. Perfect. Right, I don't need the... How lovely a room bear.
I don't think I've ever been to this hole. It's fine. This is still the most... I hate this. I really hate this. Like, you have this statue here, you have this fireplace, and they put this here. Like, ugh. They could have put this anywhere else. Like, why not put it here? Or, like, here. Yeah, honestly, they should put it here. You can put it in this corner here and, like, add a light or something. It'd be better. Like, why is this here? I get it. So when you morph in, you can just go straight to here when you come back or whatever. But, like, ew. I hate it. Just move it. Like, I want to mod my game just to remove that eyesore because I'm never going to use the arena. Eat so yeah. Well, I took you, Mama, to yeah, yeah, yeah. You think I'm dead whenever I'm gone for like five seconds. Alright, so this has still been doing the most on the scaling. This just does better with full moon sorceries. This does scale with decks though, so it might eventually get better as we go up. But we're not there yet. So for now, let's lose that. And now I need a uh, somber ancient dragon smithing stone. So cool to know that ancient dragons apparently are made of smithing stone. Stone scales and all. I guess that makes sense. So that was like, what, 311? What does this do now? We can remove this because we're not going to use it for a while. 346. Oh my... This is for bosses. We're gonna need that for room bear. Yeah. So, we haven't needed our other spells so far, which is fine, because I think we're probably gonna go against a boss soon if we're going to, like, Godwin stuff, right? I assume there's a boss related to Godwin. And then... Actually, now that I think about it, there's a, there has to be, because there's Fortisax, right? So maybe Fortisax is gonna be in the arena or something? Fortisax. I do love how some of the dragon names got changed in localization. Like Fortisax. I, I like. I get it. They don't want him to just be Fortisax, but like no one's gonna get the reference unless you know Japanese. So it's like, just let him be called Fortisax, man. But oh well, it's Fortisax. Uh, a whopping somber eight smother, <laughs> eight somber ancient dragon smithing stones can be found. That's a lot of options. I like that. America Sims, why not replace one of the statues in the main hall? That yeah, that honestly, that'd be smart. The fireplace, yeah, <laughs> fireplace is lots of America Sims. Uh, dragons also made of gravel. If you believe the they who say, of course I believe they who say. Here's the thing, the term it is said or toyu is used constantly in Japanese in item descriptions. Like you would have to like if you were like, well, if you believe blah blah blah, you'd have to literally doubt like. Pretty much like half the item descriptions in any given Souls game. It's ridiculous. All right, let's see how crazy my damage is. Do I one shot these guys? Nope, but almost do. <laughs> oh my. The only time I actually approve of the curve. Oh, can I hit the room bear from up here? Maybe, but the angle is going to be awkward, so let's not risk it. We'll do it from up here instead. Let me have fun, Elden Ring. Why? 
Whatever. Down here, gotcha. Are we done? Are we done, Mr. Room Bear? Deal with this, with this boy up here. All right. Now where was I? There we go. Okay. Let's try that again. Uh, what's the reference? You just need the second gra Graven Talisman. Let's see. There's a stronger version of this, right? Yeah. Just need that and I'll have, like, full sorcery damage. Uh, that could hold some weight to the idea of Nox and Newman with the they say or it is said. Yeah, the thing is with the- it, it's used constantly and there's really no point in doubting. Whenever I have done analysis for Bloodborne, Demon Souls, Dark Souls, Dark Souls 2, Dark Souls 3, and there's never been a time where I'm like, well, it says it is said, or they say, or it's rumored, or whatever the, the thing the localization chooses. And again, the localization, nine times out of ten, removes this in their translation. Because it's a literary device. It's fluff. It doesn't actually add anything. It's not there to make you doubt something. It's there to just be a framing device. Which again, is fine. I have no problem with that. But people need to accept that in analysis, if you're looking at the Japanese script, that phrase is used constantly. Hence why the localization removes it. Because no one's gonna be like, well, of course in the it said that in it said that light is time in Dark Souls, so we should totally doubt that basic information, which is demonstrable by literally everything else. It's like, no, of course not. They do it for like they do it whenever Miyazaki feels like putting it in there to make things things sound more I guess flowery is the best word for it, though. It's not really that. And the phrase is used in the Japanese language liberally as it is and isn't taken literally in most of those cases. So, like, it's just one of those things that you shouldn't pay attention to too hard. It really isn't. Always act from the position that something is true until given reason to doubt. Like, say, Loretta being an Albanoric. Plenty of reason to doubt that. Not least of witches or blood. Okay. There we go. There we go. We'll bear down. Only four thousand for that. Oh, lump of flesh. Oh, Prince Death Cyst. Huh. Room Bear not doing too hot, huh? Is that a more powerful version? Yeah, it's a more powerful version of this, huh? Yeah, makes sense. It said that the cyst came from the... Look! It said, guys! You better doubt it, because it said it said. <laughs> it said the cyst came from the corrupted visage of one unable to die a true death. Uh, indeed, it comes from the Prince of Death, Sion of the Golden Bow, and First of the Dead among the... Oh, yeah, it's just basic goblin information. Where do you think Godwin is half-half uh, Badland Warrior and half Newman God? Very different cultures, right? Uh, Badlands came after, though, right? Because the Badlands uh, was originally Godfrey. I assume Godfrey came from the Lands Between, right? And Badlands were established up north when he uh, when he left as Tarnished. Yeah. I didn't even have to hold myself on that one. I was just like, this thing's just going to die by the time this spell is done. another level up so let's go this way
I'm very curious. So is this a separate demigod, or is this supposed to also represent Godwin? Very curious why one of these are here. Because it at least doesn't look like the the people being laid to rest there are statues. They're all he It seems like the idea is that they're actually just headless demigods, but that has interesting implications then. Surprise attacks. Oh, well, that, that didn't work. You got behind the wall. Oh, boy. That almost killed me. What's in here? Somber Smithing Stone 7, another one. I can't believe I found two of them. Oh, thank you, game. I don't know what I'm gonna use this one on, but maybe on my Moon Veil. Since again, I'm not gonna use Renala's stuff until my dex is at least high enough to compete. Just giving me. Nice! Woo! That feels good! <laughs> oh god, sorcery can be so fun in this game. surprisingly sure. I forget if it was Teen Sith or Ellie or whoever, but someone mentioned that, and I was like, I wonder how short. Yeah, it's short. Also, that doesn't do as much damage as I was hoping. Seems like it's only good when you want to track enemies who are super mobile. Like that. That would have actually been guaranteed to hit. Yeah. It's essentially an insurance policy, which I do not mind. Didn't level up there. I mean, it did lock on. I keep saying level up for things I shouldn't be saying. Get back here, you damn headless horse. Nope, nothing back here. Just a really weird graphic. Lightning great bolts. Huh? Yeah, there has to have been contact between the Eternal City and the Royal Capital above. There's no way we're finding this type of stuff here. And it was all just like, oh well, oopsie, just happened to find its way down here. They brought Godwin Berry down here to give him a nursery burial, it seems. Oh, dang. dang it, you're headless, that's awkward. from me. Yeah, that's, uh, that's not working. Dang. Yeah, fall to your death. Ooh, Silver six, Spinning Stone 6. I don't think I need that, but... Reminded why these guys are, can be obnoxious. Oh my gosh. Oh my 
god, they just block everything! I- I need my ambush, uh... Dang it, I missed that shit, my shot. Dang it. There we go. Amy with your horse! There we go. Alrighty. We can get a level up, so try not to die is my goal right now. Huh, item near this broken tree. Without a corpse. Okay, just ashes. Okay, nothing nothing crazy there. Hi, right, BRB. See you, Adolphus. No problem. want to maximize my angle. Nice. Smithing stone. Fine. Oh my. Let's deal with you now, buddy. Oh, that's not what I want to do. There we go. Where where where's your where's your death sickness? Where is it? Where's the the spirits of the dead, the souls of the damned powering you? Know? Oh! Oh I see. Wait a second. Yes, I could jump down and kill you instantly, but that'd be no fun. Then again, neither of you, so. Oh no! Oh my gosh, you warp every time we get a. Okay, next time he gets off his horse, I jump down, I stab him on the floor. This is, uh, this is what I get for trying to, trying to do something different. Oh my god, oh my god every time I get behind you! Just stop it. Ah, my own... Hoist by my own petard. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we gotta get up there, huh? Isn't there like a jump point back here or something I saw? Or am I crazy? Might have been for over there that I'm thinking. No, no, there was definitely a jump point. Okay, I'm not, I'm not that nuts. weird. I mean, it's not the weirdest thing in the world. Because we see, like, this, this, and this, but, like, this seems to very clearly be... Yeah, where's this? This stuff you can imagine all comes from the same roots as the Erd tree. This it isn't as obvious. That's weird. This is the thing that uh, Vatim people were, were telling me about. The possibility that this was the quote-unquote great tree. Doesn't look, uh, looks a little small for a great tree if you ask me, but what do I know? Oh, you count as a boss. Huh. I, is it weird that I, is it weird for me that I fought this person? as not a boss, so it's weird for me to see now this as a boss. I guess it's, it's the main character of the original knight, right? But it's like, huh. I guess... Uh, I don't know how I feel about all this.
<laughs> and boss dead. Ooh, 30k, not bad. See, Lura's tree. I have so much stuff I need to start organizing for my storage. Here we go. Sir's tree, weapon of one to two, honored as foremost one crucible knights. That makes sense. The primordial form of the earth tree is close to nat the nature of life itself, and this spear model on this crucible is employed. Hmm. We are? Okay. So, we're finding lots of these golden leaves outside here. So I can understand why people at least might think this could be the crucible. But from what I understand, the crucible is the just the earth tree, so... So I guess this has to be a part of the Erd Tree, but it's hollowed out thanks to Godwin, maybe? Oh. Armor, too. Uh, crucible Tree Armor. The Great Tree Ornamentation. Yeah, so that is the Night Sierra's Mark, displayed also by her men. Holds the power of Crucible. Yeah, yeah, Everything about that makes sense. Who served Godfrey? Holds power for the. Eh, nothing crazy here. Uh, this is the knight from which all other tree knights are derived. She's their commander. I love fighting the Crucible Knights. I can parry all their attacks now. That's cool. I'm glad that you got used to the parrying for them. Also, I'm close to like two level ups. So, like, let's hopefully not die here. Oh, I can probably get on that roof, can I? Let's do it. Yeah, I know this game. Another stone sword key. How many is that now? Okay, so they're not key items. No? I'm kind of confused. Where are these things? They're not materials. Not here. It has to be key items. Yeah, there they are. Seven of them, huh? we go from here chat up up in order to oh wait a second i hear something and i see something even better Oh, there you are. I was like, I know you're up here somewhere. Yeah, we're gonna just deal with Basilisk with melee, because they're not worth the the runes for killing the sorcery for a quick, uh, quick level. I can do this much better. I'm su kind of surprised by finding no regular herb, uh, even b uh, by the earth tree. I guess she really has to be um, under the sun, where the, it's gold up top, huh?
Oh. Well. Up and across the roots, yeah. Up and across the roots is where I go, and uh, I failed. I wanted to dismount so I could deal with him on... Oh, no. Okay, we want to go back here. As much as I love the easy farm, I don't want to risk falling and losing all my runes, so we will do this. Six runes, I just noticed, huh? Well, this place isn't as hellish as I was expecting, so. Nice. Oh my gosh. Alright, so first we gotta deal with this one up here. Dang it. So I can get one more off. Perfect. Okay, guys, how do I uh, two-hand my left-hand weapon? Because clearly I don't know how I'm doing, what I'm doing. Woo! That is the most uh, fortunate save of my life, if I do say so myself. Oh, boy. But yeah, I'm feeling pretty embarrassed right now. I don't know how to actually... Uh, Two hand, my left hand weapon in this game. Oh boy. Okay, you gonna block again or? Uh, so on PC, hold E and left click. I'm using a controller, Ellie, so give me a controller command. I don't use PC controls in from soft games. Uh, what do you think I am, crazy? But thank you for the advice. Go to combat mode, like where you use your pouch items, and attack with your offhand weapon. Uh, use pouch items? Oh. Oh! Huh. I'll be honest, that's kind of awkward. Because I, I, I feel like the mapping button is something completely different. Whereas I click it. But I get, I get, I get the idea though, right? Because they don't want you to be able to try to go to this while doing your while you're switching and stuff. That could be awkward. But yeah, it's, it's a bit weird if I miss and do say so. But cool, now I know. Really? That looks open though, so I think I should go there. There might be stuff up there that I haven't seen. Let me double check. 
So Sierra is there, and she's got a spare set of armor there. Hmm. It is. It's difficult to accomplish in a fight. I know I use controller. Check my comment earlier. Yeah, I, I checked. Don't worry. In DS2, you would click Y to two hand, right hand, and hold two left one out. Yeah. So what? Yeah, that, that's the that's the problem with the new stuff they did with the jumping mechanic and the new pouch system and all that. It definitely has that weird uh, weirdness to it, where it doesn't feel as smooth as it was when Dark Souls was made around just you know, hey, you just have your weapon, use that. It was much nicer when it was like, uh, click or press. fall from up here all right so i think i've cleared everything except this all right guys i'm confident that i won't get myself killed like an idiot but it is me so place your bets you done with your whole death thing It's me, so place your bets. <laughs> ah. Oh, God. Why am I like this? Man. I'm having so much fun, though, honestly. Like, it's just kind of crazy when you think about it. The open world aspect of this game really does, uh really does uh, help make this feel like a new spin. It's not like I'm going from Dark Souls to this and playing like the same old spiel. Don't get me wrong, they could definitely do better in some areas with this. I'm not saying it's perfect. But, uh, I was one of those people who was, uh, very tepidly, uh, excited about the idea of having an open world dynamic to these games. And I think it works well. Now, I wouldn't want to say, like, oh my god, Dark Souls 4 needs to be open world or something like that. I wouldn't go that far. I definitely miss having these games be somewhat smaller in scale. More compact, with less filler. But, uh, there's no denying that there's definitely something to be said about the scope of this open world and what they've been able to fill it with. Though, um, admittedly, they probably could do better with an enemy variety. Enemies so far have been fairly limited. It definitely feels like they just had the normal number of bosses for a regular Dark Souls or Demon Souls or Bloodborne or whatever. But they now have to spread it across a larger area. They end up with lots of repeat bosses and crap like that, which, uh, not good. Yeah, we're not even gonna play around now. I have, uh, I have so many rooms I need to keep hold of. Oh, is Archer Boy gonna get in my way? I don't think so, but... Oh, he is. I think he is. But he seems to be stuck behind, uh, things, so he won't bug bother me. Yay. Oh, right. No, it's this. There we go. The button press part's where it's especially awkward. Because you have to hold down the triangle while doing the left thing afterward. It's like, oh boy, that's definitely not easy to do in a fight or on the fly. Down. 
Uh, do we need this for anything? I already got the stuff I want from Arnala, right? Oh, boy. From Arnala, right? Well, that was rude. Alright, so I'm assuming nothing's... Oh, right. No more reason for you guys to be here, huh? Yeah, I guess this has to be separate from Godwin, huh? Yeah, and these are remains, so... So we've covered this area pretty thoroughly, right, chat? So let's do up here. No, this is the beginning, so this is where we want to go. Can't wait. Can't wait to uh, fight another big dragon. Ooh. Whoa. Wasn't expecting that to be my answer, but okay. Let's, uh, let's fix that, shall we? Again, this will be my new farming spot, I get the feeling. I hope I never have to use it, but if I do, boy, that's gonna be useful. Perfect. The question is, when should I start considering taking the Radagon icon off? I guess when I start hitting like the 40s or something, that's when it'll start having diminishing returns on upgrading my uh, spellcasting speed. Oh, mother. Uh huh. Yeah. Godwin became a fish. That's his face, all right. Huh. And the thorns here are just insect wings. Actually, you know what? You know what? I just noticed something. It's not just that those are insect wings. I think these uh, briars themselves, they look to be made of worms. Huh. Yeah, that looks like the worms. Can we get better lighting here? Yeah, those are definitely worms. Huh. Or maggots, maybe. Maybe not worms, but maggots. Because they have the fly type of thing going for them, right? I guess ma or maggots are kind of like worms, right? I, I, worms are their own thing, though, so maybe they wouldn't... Maybe they wouldn't count. Huh. Gosh, I, I have to do this on foot. All right, dragon, fly in. I know you want to. I'm going to come here and then... Oh. What's this? Fia's champion? What? Okay, we gotta use meteors. What? Not, not that much HP overall. Alright, let's see. That's not it, right? More. What? yeah! Oh, so Fia's champion. So this has to be all the people Fia slept with, right? Is this what Rajir was talking about? About how he felt like he was... I remember him mentioning something. Like he was going to be like a problem that could harm us in the future. So is this what he was 
possibly feeling in his gut? Did Thea, like, copy his spirit energy or some shit? Duplicated it on her mental USB or some crap? The soul USB? Oh wow, actually dodged it. Who's next? I'm gonna do this in advance. Oh! I see. Lionel the Lionhearted. Are you one of the people that was at the Radon? Okay, I gotta avoid these people. Oh boy, this is an interesting uh, boss fight. I was expecting Fortisax, but I guess that's a separate thing. Let's go this way? Oh no. To be honest, I could probably solo the other guys, no problem. The only reason I'm not using my uh, Comet Azure is because I assume they're going to dodge roll. Though maybe Rinala's full moon would... No, because I'm not going to use magic attacks. I'm going to use rock sling to get around there. <laughs> get around them. Okay. Boss? Boss? Okay. Let's see how bad you are. Oh, you're... Alright, where's Rogier? Okay, so he can outdo that for me. That or I need to be more aggressive. I guess we could just make that a rock sling battle, but I really want to save the rock slings and all I'm going to use for when I'm kiting the three stooges. Because I'm assuming that's the last wave. If not, oh boy, this boss fight's going to go for a while. This is kind of neat, though. It's a different kind of boss fight. It's like waves of NPC enemies. In the game, she's at least give you a chance to get your runes back. Though, honestly, 3k runes is really nothing. Especially when I can get 4k from every one of those gargoyles out there. Ow. Well. So that was two that was two crimson tear, uh, tears I did not need to use. Of course. Dang it. You can hit me on the counter too.
Okay. And now we focus on just hiding these guys and making sure that whoever's closest gets hit. Because I feel like I'm going to have to switch targets a lot. Where's the third one? Oh, there they are. That was a waste. Okay, that's one down. That's surprisingly easy. Lionel, using Death Prince stuff, I guess. Is he using the Death Prince staff? I mean, interesting. Well, I don't worry about Shield Boy, because Shield Boy's just gonna block everything. Uh, that was uh, dangerous. So it seems like none of them have ranged spells except for the Death Prince attack, so that's good. Of course, it breaks lock on. Dang it. I'm not getting all three hits on it, though. That's awkward. Alright, buddy, you. Oh! There we go, and dead. Alright, this has to be it, right? Yeah, Fia's miss. I don't know why I learned that. Now it's a uh, sorcery, okay. Creates a deathly mist before the caster, which inflicts death blight upon those who. Oh. Uh, skip the law. The sorcerer is developed to oppose the round table holes. Effective only against the target. Ah, I see. Kill tarnished. Oh, Fia! There you are, and I see you also have a thing here. Hey, girl. Ah, there you are. I knew you would come. What is it you intend to deny us and our ways like the dogmatic brutes of the Golden Order? Uh... <laughs> I want hugs! I am the guardian Good job. Thanks, thanks! They call me a foul and rotten. Listen, I just want to be hugged by you. Yet you still wish to be held by me. <laughs> I am such a simp. Secret. We don't want anyone around here to overhear us. <laughs> Have you ever seen a hollow brand? <sighs> when the first of the demigods died, his flesh was marked with the half wheel wound of the centipede. Uh -huh. Godwin's hollow brand has since been recovered at the round table hall. Oh, but so there is another hollow brand out there somewhere. Oh, did you get that from I D then? Find it. Before the time comes, we receive our Lord. When Godwin died, a hollow brand scored his flesh, but another exists. Another mark in the shape of the half wheel wound of the centipede. Yeah, it's Ronnie, and right? I must find it. Before the time comes, we receive our Lord. My hands will be dirtied once more by the deed. Will you still let me hold you? Even then, I'm a simp apparently. When Godwin died, yeah, yeah. and I must before the time. Yeah, okay. Come closer. I don't want anyone to hear us. <laughs> yeah, like you don't want anyone in this giant cavern to possibly hear us. It's not like you can see anyone coming a mile away. Oh my. We'll worry about that in a sec. So we'll save those. Wait. Wait. I saw a second great. Oh my god, Miyazaki. You guys are. Ay, ay, ay. Uh, so we did all our 
big stuff, so... Let's get our other spells out. Because I feel like we're not going to fight bosses for a little bit. Actually, you know what? I don't know if that's a boss. That might take me to four to sex. I don't know. I assume going through that portal won't mess up Thea's quest. Tell me now if I'm making a mistake in my assumption. Uh, we want to keep that. Night Maiden's Mist is still an option. I have not used this hammer yet, so I'm just not gonna... I'm just not. Uh... Ah, uh, you know what? I want to do this. This. Then piercer. I'm not going to use the hammer because we just haven't found a good place to slot it in for a situation. Uh, this this was use this was use this this uh, my, the fight with Rogier told me that this is literally just pointless. This is just like crowd control, keep someone out of an area when you're trying to do stuff. But they can just range you anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh. Uh. Mm. This for sure. Like this. And then... And Starlight. Perfect. In the meantime, Godwin Fish. You gotta get the half centipede. Okay, so... I, I shouldn't do this until I get the half centipede. And then I guess this must lead to four to sex, huh? Okay. Hmm. Pretty crazy. Now I guess we could do Ainsel River. But for now, I want to do... Uh, I want to do the Eternal City. Yeah, we haven't done Nocron, right? Because we didn't go through here. So I need to do Ronnie's quest to get the Half Centipede first. And this advance Ronnie's quest. Oh. Okay. Hey, big boy! So I guess our, our journey is to go down there, huh? Because there's big boy here and we got stuff. Maybe there's a boss here. Uh, huh. A lot of runes on the line, so I better not die. Rejuvenating boluses. Yeah, there's no way these are supposed to be intentional statues. No way. Wait, what? Oh, that's a silver tear. Silver tear becoming human characters. I think that, that pretty much sinks it for me. Is that supposed to be night folk slash not? Uh, so it looks like it's supposed to go down there. Well, guess that, uh, I guess the crossbowmen killed themselves. Bless you'll do. At least I know I'll have a lot of chances to make right by any NPCs I accidentally anger. But that's not happening, so. Did you go to the Divine Tower in the Lake Place? No, I have not been able to go there yet. I, I don't have the thing I need. I think I need to do Ronnie's quest to get it first. Wow. It's pointless. Okay. Like, really? Nothing special going over here? Just angry crossbow woman? I don't even know why I collect items. I don't craft. 
I say that, and then I'm gonna need to craft, like, next stream or this stream or something, right? Oh my god, I hate the jump sometimes. I was trying to go farther, but it just did a mini jump instead. Okay. You have to run when you do your jumps. That's the problem. Thanks, game. Also, Thea, I love you, but your buff sucks. So, uh... Let me just mosey my way around to wherever that Baldigan blessing is. There it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get rid of my five extra... Five minus eight. Oh my god, it killed itself again. Also, thank you, runes, for being here. Perfect. Now that's a normal thing. Oh. That's what I get for trying to look close up at the thing that's hostile to me. Darn. That's where you get the half semi to advance the uh, Fia's quest. Okay, yeah, so don't worry. I'll, I'll, I'll be doing everything that I can normally. So when I get these items, you don't have to worry about telling me. I'm not trying to fast track Fia's quest or anything. Just I, just knowing that it's there oh, makes me happy enough. Let's see. Nice sacred ground. I gotta be careful. I could end up losing 50k out of this. There we go. Oh, let's see if I can get a good look at the face this time. Dang it, no. No, it looks like a normal person. Doesn't have black eyes like the Nox here. Oh, wait! These guys are naked. So maybe... Maybe they're supposed to be the, uh... What do you call them? The mercenaries. But does that make sense? Because they have the bright... Uh... Were the... Were the mercenary the... Uh, what was it? The fallen hawk or whatever? Did they have white hair? I don't recall. I guess the skin stuff could be explained by them being silver tier, so they're not able to perfectly, uh, perfectly mimic. That could also explain why night folk look the way they do. Because they're always going to be influenced by the, the nature of the silver. that I didn't need refilling. Black Wet Blade, huh. What does that improve? Poison, Blood, and Occult. Occult is just arcane, so that makes sense. Poison and Blood, though. Hmm. Looks like a type of altar, but... Very strange. Something to uplift here. Oh boy. A 
I can go outside there. Cool. I'm just gonna get this shot because it seems like a really cool shot to have. Just look at that. That's 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 pretty badass if I do say so myself. Mm -hmm. Could probably get slightly closer. I could always adjust my zoom too. Sorry, chat, just... I really love good shots. I don't know if I'm ever going to cover this stuff, but it's always cool to get it now. There we go. Worshipped here. Surrounded by those petrified. Oh, okay. Can't do a uh, backstab, huh? Got it. Mimic tear ashes. Well, you're telling me that these uh, mimic tears have a. Uh, Wait, wait, I thought I got that from the boss fight earlier. What did I get from that? Oh no, I got the mask from the boss fight, right? Also, har har, they're using the Titanite slab for the background on these things, the runes from there. That is hilarious. Anyway. Uh, attempt to, yeah, okay. Guess it makes sense why they're giving it such respect then. All right, what's this? Oh yeah, that would have killed me. Oh, you can't get up here normally, huh? Nox Flowing Hammer makes sense. Oh, a big bowl. That made a silver tier too, huh? Yeah, it's got that same silvery, metallic, watery look to it. Uh, someone giving worship to that? Is that a priest or? Uh, looks like it might be a priestess. Is that nobody else? Yeah, it looks pretty safe. Maybe you can go around that corner. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's somebody. Silver tier, you don't need to be as hard as a giant boulder. Hey, these are the things that hit you when they teleport in Celia and Rhea Lucaria, aren't they? Yeah, it has a larval tier, so yeah, it has to be a silver tier. Okay. That's neat. So, do those get summoned from the Eternal City, or do they just have their own? Curious. Very cool. 
Because this looks almost like a, a ritual platform where you could end up, like, teleporting things, so. Huh. Looks like this was some kind of church. Uh, yeah, it is the sacred ground. Makes sense. Gosh, another one. Yeah, oh my gosh, they just summon a second one when you do it, and then they merge the things so they're in sync together. That is so weird. Okay, that's uh, one of the crystal things in the sky. Gotcha. Funny how these are so low, considering how high up we are. Oh, there's the place we were at. The ruins. More knocks. Oh, I can say more silver gears. There's a troll down here that they would think I would play. I have to imagine that this is a troll. It's not a troll fight, so it can't be a lot. That's a lot of damage. What what sword is that? Is that the same sword that normal trolls have? I don't know why, it looks different to me. Maybe I'm just misremembering. I'm thinking like the Karian sword or something instead. mimic anything? There you go. So you mimic regular people. That's just a normal great sword, right? Do I hand her maybe? Yeah, I'm not seeing anything, uh, anything happening with you, so... That's one way to deal with the problem. No troll from you. I'm getting so many level ups this stream. It's kind of crazy. No boss, really? A warp point? Oh boy, where is this going to take me? All right, what are you gonna give me more glove work? Oh, Finger Slayer Blade. Oh, right, because Ronnie, right. That explains how this advances her quest. I assume this is a key item then. Yeah, there it is. Hidden treasure, okay, yeah, so this is the secret treasure that they're got. Born of a corpse. Blood branch fetch has proved the high trees are given by the eternal sin, symbolizes its downfall. And they're keeping this under their Lord of Night, or their potential Lord of Night they were trying to create. Hmm. <sighs> Alright, let's see what this takes me. I'm gonna regret it, aren't I? Oh! Well, 
that's convenient. I don't know why they have a warp gate for up here, but whatever. Works for me. So I can advance Ronnie's thing now. I also have Celibus's quest, right? The Celibus's quest, like, negate Ronnie's quest. Like, if I do what Celibus wants me to, I'll, like, betray Ronnie or something and I can't complete her quest. Is that a possibility? thing I need to do is go see the Lord of Blood, I guess, but I don't know how I'm going to do that. Let's go check with Fare. Uh, I haven't done Big Pot yet. I think I'm at a level where I can definitely do Big Pot, though. So, that's probably how we want to round things off here. I also think I'm doing enough damage at this point that I don't have to worry about, uh, don't have to worry about anything in regards to... No, Vari's still here, so... So, Vari, can I go? Sure to try. I'm quite... Oh my god, you, you're gonna make me have to do PvP, seriously? Is there really no way around this? Alright, how much damage do I do here, buddy? Two shop for 500? You're like a basilisk. Not worth it. Hmm. You know these guys are just kind of staring at the church like, ooh, ah, blood. wonder what this is all about. Curious little guys. Oh my gosh, I can one-shot these things. I can one-shot them with my sword! This does scale with dex, right? That's why I wanted it. Yeah, it does. So, yeah, it has terrible strength scaling, but great dex scaling. So it's good for sorcerers. Hmm. So I have Volcano Manor. But I want to do the thing with Raya first, because apparently she can take me there herself. Ronnie. Yes, I might as well do the stuff that doesn't involve quest lines for people to round things off, and then we can kind of figure out what we're doing next time. Yeah. Right, Selen. Uh, do I have. Can I save Selen now? I haven't done her thing, so. Hello, master. My apprentice. Give me a moment later. I have a favor to ask. Oh. Well, I got nothing else I want from you, so... The form you see before you is merely a projection. Yeah, I kind of figured. My body lies elsewhere. But the academy shackles prevent it being moved. My body is on the weeping Oh, so it's the academy the that locked you up. Of the lands between imprisoned in the ruins just down from the church of marika past the plain of the wandering mausoleum okay can you make the journey to my body sure i have something that i can only trust with you who could have guessed what a place to find master lusat you have my gratitude this is all your work i am truly pleased to have you as an apprentice and a kindred spirit. Nice. This is a mere token of my thanks. Please take it. This brings us a full step closer. The bodies of Masters Azure and Lusat can be admitted to the Academy. If only I could undo these wretched shackles. Uh huh. My body is in prison. Yeah, okay. You make the journey. I have something. Uh huh. Uh. They're selling. I haven't done Red Main either now that I think about it, because 
everything got cleared, right? But it has to return now, right? Uh, what does Millicent got to say? We haven't done anything with Millicent or Dowry either. Yep. I hoped to see you again. To be honest, you're not looking too much better. For when last we met, I fainted before I could even thank you. Well, that's nice. Of Everything you. You're so is thoughtful. as you said. Since inserting the needle, the scarlet rot has ceased to writhe. That's good. Even the nightmares have abated. And now, though I can scarcely believe it myself, I can move as I please. That's nice. Not that I could ever truly repay you, but I would like you to have this by way of thanks. A token though it is. Oh! Millennia stuff. I'm considering leaving on a journey with the needle buried in my flesh. I started to recall, oh. but dimly, my destiny. It's all thanks to you. Oh. My name is Millicent. Hey, Millicent. I pray fate permits us meet again. I'm considering leave with the needle. My destiny. Uh huh. Isn't she wearing the same outfit as uh? Melina. Like, doesn't Melina just have a cloak? Whatever. Let's see how my sword stands up to the stuff here. So if I ambush them in one shot, otherwise... Is it weird that I'm getting used to Kaelid? I don't think I ever would have had that feeling, but it's like, hey, you know, Kaelid, it's it's pretty all right. Thank you. Thank you. Let's see what Gowry's doing. Gowry! His dog. Still there. Being a dog. I just find it funny how he put a collar on it and everything. God, even these dogs aren't that bad. Oh! Millicent, where's Gowry? Oh, hello again. I accidentally advanced Something your quest, my bad. about this place felt familiar to me, so I decided to pay a visit. You still don't got an arm. Hoping to find someone here, but I've only found emptiness. Perhaps oh, you're looking for daddy. Before my departure, I needed someone to say farewell to. Well, never mind that. I must focus on my journey. For which I have you to thank. I must stay strong. Uh huh. Well, I must. F I must. Yeah. Let's try this. So, uh. Actually, I want to try this. Is this actually the better route? Okay, so this thing's telling me Gowry's here still, so... I'm gonna assume he just disappears because he can't say hi to his daughter or some shit. Yeah, this looks like the better route.
Hey, Gallery, we're back. Ah, welcome, welcome. How may I help? You brought back one of your little kin servants and everything. Study sorcery. Hmm. So sorcerers from Celia come to... Huh. It's so weird having the mask people here, but that's like a Ray Lucaria thing. It seems like sorcerers come from Celia, so there must be a lot of back and forth coming. Oh, you noticed, did you? Like they go, indeed. People from Celia go to the academy, then come back. It seems the memories eaten away by the rotting sickness yet remain, but faintly. Yes, that's what However, she says. She has no need of me anymore. Oh no, she must embark on her journey and stare her fate in the eye. I mustn't impede. As I've so aged, dead. I found the best way to aid the young is to be forgotten. Huh. Well, I mean, you could at least, you know, wish her well. Do you need me for something else? Well, yes. Okay. I guess we just don't do anything with him anymore. Okay. I guess his stuff is done. Uh... Oh, uh, we never did this here. I could probably do this now. Okay, so first, I want to kill that room bear. To screw that room bear. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to... Oh boy, the loading. We're gonna do re red main next time because I want to wrap things up now. And it's been a while since I felt the need to put you on, huh? All right, so we're gonna swap everything out. Alright, let's see if we can take care of this. We took care of a uh, moon bear at the other place, so it's possible. Yeah, okay. Perfect. I don't do nearly enough damage to kill that thing before he gets to me, huh? God, Dragon Barrow! So nuts. All right, so let's just level up then and do the boss. Gosh, room bear. dying like what what are what is jumping off cliffs and falling to their deaths like what okay yeah so that's what we got here oh that's a bit more than i wanted but well that is what it is stop it <laughs> more for decks yeah and we're getting pretty high like Oh yeah, that's noticeable. Yeah, that's a noticeable improvement. It's 
So yeah, I think what we do is when I get to like 40, I start considering uh, whether I need to get off the decks. Until then, though. Until then, though, it's the best stat to upgrade right now. Because I'm doing decent damage. The problem is uh, casting speed for my regular spells. Though, again, I'm not doing enough damage to kill that thing yet. That might need a max staff. Yeah, I had an idea, but I'm like, nah, that's not gonna work because it's not a. Does uh, Common Azure count as a meteor spell? Asking for a friend. It would. It, I assume it goes into like the the kind of a uh, star type of spell. So I don't know if those would count. So. Damn it. My angle was slightly off. Okay, but now I know. It's definitely doable. And I can do it without alerting the other one. I need a better angle, that's all. I can get both of them, honestly. I could probably go from where I'm starting position is. And if I can lock onto the other one when I do all that, I can probably get them both in for two for one. Ooh, maybe this is how I get the room bare. Do it from back here, where it can't really fit through, hopefully. back there might be the better take because where does he stand yeah so here damn it I messed that up chat Go back to where you were. You saw nothing. Ignore the man with a giant bright lantern illuminating him in the bushes. Well. <laughs> this is awkward. Guess I now have this as an option. The fuck? Oh, this rock! 
Okay, uh, guys, we're restarting that. Oh, never mind. We're not restarting that. Oh my god, so much went wrong there. So much went wrong. Ah! Okay, now I need- I know what I need to do. Let me just get my spell set up in advance so I don't fuck this up. <sighs> I know I can do this two for one thing. It's definitely possible. There we go. That's all I need to do. Again, stuff like that ledge that doesn't hurt me whatsoever, and yet there's multiple ways so I can like slowly come down, makes me think that they adjusted, uh, adjusted height distance for stuff. Very, pretty late in development. do it like I planned. I didn't get the angle quite right, but it worked out. And yeah, more Drake Talisman, because of course. Oh, and I just got like a level up. Oh! Nice. Gosh, stuff is still dying. <laughs> Oh, that's way too much. That's a mistake. I didn't realize it was that much. Well, oopsie. I was gonna say Grank. I already beat the boss for this area, right? We already commandeered him, lol. Pretty sure, right? Yeah, I don't see him. Yeah, okay, he's dead. So he has to be a gargoyle too, but he's aligned with, uh... He's aligned with our our boy, our boy uh, God, or I guess Malakath, I should say. He's got some of that death room. Well, chat, I think that's where we're gonna call it. Things have been uh, pretty great going through here underground. Some really neat stuff. We got some stuff to advance Ronnie's quest line. I also have stuff to go through Ansel River. I think we're going to do that next time. So I think what it's going to be is we're going to do Red Bank Castle, Selen, uh, probably Ronnie, and then depending on how much time, I guess we'll do Ansel. Because it's possible that Ronnie, I assume Ronnie's quest might take, have us go to Ansel, like, right away. So it's like, okay. So I think until until that time, let's just get prepared for the fun times here at Red Main Castle. So, thanks to everyone for showing up. It was great. Please like and subscribe. Gotta get the grift in. Make sure that I can get this channel monetized one day, maybe. But hey, it's up to you. Do you like what I do here? Do you like to see more of it? Consider. Oh boy. That's gonna be quite the experience we're gonna have ahead of us. Well. Until then, we're going to probably do some more Elden Ring mixed with Dark Souls and stuff again on and off to help kind of break things up. But I think it's going pretty great. I'm enjoying this nice, slow, casual playthrough through the game. So until then, bye, guys.